A billionaire now, that's the boss. Bruce Springsteen's net worth is estimated by Forbes to be $1.1 billion, referring to the figure as conservative. Although Springsteen, 74, has been in the music industry for almost 60 years, the majority of his money has been established in the last few years. In 2021, he became the most expensive musician to ever sell a catalog when he sold it to Sony for an estimated $500 to $550 million. Two years later, Polestar revealed that more than 3.4 million tickets were sold during Springsteen's Globe Tour, bringing in close to $380 million in ticket income. Its 200-minute running time was 40 minutes longer than most other sets of his lately, all of which already test and transcend what a guy in his early 70s who recently recovered from illness ought to be pulling off, Variety's Chris Willman wrote in a review of one of the shows from that tour. Over the course of his career, Bruce Springsteen has produced 21 studio albums, 7 live albums, 5 EPs, and 140 million album sales worldwide. Among his many achievements are 20 Grammy Awards and inductions into the Songwriters Hall of Fame and the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame. In addition, he received the Presidential Medal of Freedom in 2016 and the Kennedy Center Honors in 2009. Since his childhood days spent watching the Beatles on The Ed Sullivan Show, he has come a long way. That gave him the idea to get his first guitar and finally give a live performance. In an interview from 2014, Springsteen remarked of the Beatles, this was different, shifted the lay of the land. For men, writing their own songs and performing. There didn't seem to be any way out of my house until rock and roll arrived, but it opened up a whole new universe of possibilities. In 1973, he released Greetings from Asbury Park, NJ, his debut album starring the group that would later become the E Street Band. 1975 saw Springsteen's breakthrough release of Born to Run. In addition to songs like Dancing in the Dark, Born in the USA, and I'm on Fire, his single of the same name turned into maybe his biggest hit. Apart from his vast collection and busy touring schedule, Springsteen also performed two residencies on Broadway, which ran for 267 performances and brought in $113,058,952 at the box office. Springsteen is still working hard well into his 70s. He declared in September of 2023 that he would have to postpone his tour's remaining dates in 2023 in order to obtain treatment for peptic ulcer disease. Since then, he has gone backstage and is currently touring Europe. On July 21, the billionaire will play his next gig in Norway.